Hey guys, Jeff here, and it's time to unveil the crazy idea I told you about a couple weeks ago. So what is this idea for 2012? Well, it involves me and getting in shape. Um, and it started a couple weeks ago. I was at basketball practice with my daughter, and I'm helping to coach the defense, and one of the girls had to leave. And so the coach asked me to fill in during the scrimmage. And after about 10 or 15 minutes of running up and down the court with 6th grade girls, I was sucking some major air, and I realized, okay, it's time for some changes. So I contacted my friend Ed down at Ed's gym and said, Ed, what would it look like for you to train me to get me in shape over the next several months? We brainstormed and came up with this crazy idea of me getting in shape and sharing it with you through social media, through blogging, through Facebook, through Twitter. Um, we're going to be sharing this journey that I'm about to take for 2012. That journey is going to look something like this. I'm going to be working out at Ed's gym four days a week for an hour a day with Ed personally getting me in shape. So think Biggest Loser, Colorado Springs version, with me and Ed pushing me along the way. But it's not just the exercise piece, it's also a change in diet. Uh, nutrition is something that Ed is really, really focused on. And if you know me, it's, you know it's something that I'm probably not all that focused on. Um, if you follow me on Facebook and Twitter, you see the pictures of the food I eat. And if you've been to our house, especially during football season, you know the deep fryer is one of the essential tools in our kitchen. So it's time for some changes in that area as well. Uh, we're going to be kicking it off January 9th with a Whole30 diet. Uh, basically for 30 days, we're going to be eating fruits, vegetables, some meat, but we're cutting out all carbs and dairy for 30 days. And Julie's going to be joining me on this. Um, because it's going to change how she cooks and how we eat as a family. So that's part of the plan. It's basically to reset um, our diet, our bodies, and to restore a healthy metabolism, get it a jump started, and then we'll be shifting our diet after the 30 days to be a more consistent, healthy diet, focused on our, my workout strategy at that point. Uh, the goal, and this is where the crazy part comes in, is to get back into the shape I was when Julie and I got married 17 years ago. At the time, I was pretty healthy, uh, weighed under 200 pounds, and right now I'm topping the scale between 260 and 265. So the goal is going to be for me to lose between 60 and 70 pounds to get under that 200 mark and be able to maintain that consistently. Um, also along the way, just losing weight isn't, isn't the only goal. It's that healthy lifestyle and it's an active lifestyle. So we're going to be doing some events along the way um, to, to measure my progress. So you can look forward to the spring hearing about maybe a 5K. We may be doing some adventure racing. We may do a half marathon uh, this year. And our ultimate goal is going to be this. Hopefully by the end of fall, I can push myself and I can finish a complete marathon and stick this bad boy on the back of my Jeep. So that's the crazy idea. And we're going to ask you to join us. We're going to ask you for your support and your encouragement on Facebook and on the blog as we as we do this. And you can follow along at JeffsCrazyIdea.com. Or you can also follow Ed's version of the story over at TrainAtEds.com. Um, he'll be sharing this journey from his perspective. Um, and I'm sure those perspectives will be very different at times. So you can see what's going through Ed's mind as a trainer versus my mind as I'm pushing through this ordeal. Um, there's also, you can join me, um, whether that be, you know, here in Colorado Springs, or if you're here and you want to go work out at Ed's with me, or if you want to do your own thing online, I encourage you to find out what it means for you to be healthy. And whether that be diet, whether that be exercise, a combination of both. Figure out what that looks like for you for 2012 and join me on this journey as well. And then sharing the story. We would love for you to join in social media and sharing this story with others in your lives who may need to hear it. I know for Julie, telling me I needed to get healthy wasn't always the most successful strategy for her, but being able to show me other people's stories helped me get motivated. So hopefully my story helps motivate you or your family and friends that need to make some lifestyle changes as far as the health is considered. So for us, the goal is going to be threefold. It's going to be getting in shape, a healthy lifestyle for me, 
uh, the weight loss, the exercise, and then those goals that are coming up. It's going to be to raise awareness for health issues and point people towards places like Ed's Gym where they can use tools that other people have to get into shape. And it's going to be to raise some funds for charity along the way as well as we participate in the 5K and adventure racing or the marathon or whatever it is we end up doing. Um, we want to add an element where we can raise some money for organizations that deal with heart issues or diabetes or those sorts of things. So stay tuned um, to here on Facebook, on Twitter, uh, to the blog. Again, that will be jeffscrazyidea.com or, eds, or train at eds.com. And you can follow the journey. And we encourage you to comment and participate in the conversation that's happening around there. Help us to get through this. Thanks for your support. I know uh, you guys are going to mean a lot to me as I push through this. And Merry Christmas. Hope you guys have a great New Year. Thanks.